One day, 10 sites. Different companies, different ethnic groups, different types of people with different backgrounds, and we've all come together in a place where there's poverty, there's gangs, there's drugs, and like we're making something better. Natasha Ellis is excited to see the revitalization of her favorite nonprofit and her community that surrounds it. West Side's the best side. The launch of the West Side Volunteer Corps started 500 strong, from painting at raising expectations to planting at truly living well and making bracelets to spread the word about the new At Promise Youth and Community Center. The West Side Volunteer Corps is about more than just volunteering. So it's about a movement of Atlantans and people around Atlanta getting reengaged in what have been neglected parts of our city to help lift them back up. John Allman is leading the West Side Future Fund, which is focused on restoring English Avenue, Vine City, the Atlanta University Center, and Ashview Heights. These neighborhoods um, have an incredible history. Some of Atlanta's great leaders for justice came out of these neighborhoods. Volunteer efforts will support four focus areas, college to career education, mixed income communities, health and wellness, and safety and security. If you live here, even if it is a pocket of poverty right now, we can all join together and do something to make that change. You are not a product of your zip code. So I'm excited because that's the story that we're telling. The West Side Future Fund was started in 2014 through a mix of public and private support. Atlanta's been known for that going way, way back. Uh, all, Mayor Hartsfield, Ivan Allen. Dan Cathy says Chick-fil-A is committed to seeing the West Side thrive. We'll be able to preserve the heritage of the people that are here, but yet also have opportunities for youth and new, new opportunities for employment, green space, affordable housing. As the Chinese proverb says, you know, the longest journey starts with one step forward. So this is one step forward, but we have a lot of steps to go.